Hey everyone, this is Francis Xavier logging on to make awesome videos one time. And here we are with the very next episode of my Pokemon Fire Red Nuzlocke. We had a sad, tragic episode last time because. Uh, lost not only Monkey Fist 2, but also. We lost Terra. That was not pleasant. Not pleasant at all. But life goes on. How fitting then that I end up losing at the graveside of all Pokemon. I believe if I'm checking the official strategy guide. I could be checking on the wrong page, but... Oh, wait. No, I'm on page 31. That's the trainer, so I'm... It's listing... <coughs> it's only listing the trainers on Rock Tunnel. Page 32 is listing the trainers on Route 8. Two Clefairies. This should be easy. No, Clefairy, technically speaking. I've decided to update my uh, I've decided to update not only my overlay as you can see but also update the rules a little bit. I can't afford to be skimpy on the No, I mean, I wanted to sh I wanted to bring him. But I don't want him to fall asleep. I'm also trying to be quiet because it is, um... Please tell me I have a chest of berry. It's like almost 10 o'clock. Uh, it's like almost 10 o'clock where I am, and I, I have been able to do this all day. I feel really guilty. And now I need to use a potion. I really think that's gonna help you? ready to get karate chopped. Once I wake up. Which will happen right about... No. Please don't be another crit. Please don't be another crit. Oh, only twice. Nice. If you really think that's going to work, I'm going to sorely disappoint you. So I'm not using my microphone. I'm not using my headset microphone. I am instead using my Blue Yeti. Get the crit, get the crit. Uh, this is, does seem a bit cheap, but I am planning to bypass a few of these trainers because their Pokemon are a little high level for, for me where I am right now. Except for this guy right here. Slash should easily be able to take it on. But then I'm going to heal up and try and get away from this uh, super nerd coming up that's got a, two grimers and a muck because I am really hesitant about that because. Mm, 
none of my Pokemon seem well equipped to take on a pure poison type just yet. Heck, I barely trust Slash to take on this Growlithe. And I certainly don't trust Joni. Ugh, oh, that was close. Really? Alright, you know what? Fine. That's the way you want, right? Yes, I will, thank you. Well, actually, first I'll switch to Mr. No, so he can get some experience. Because he desperately needs it. Then I'll switch to Slash. You know, I was about to say, it's not like Vulpix can use Roar, but she can. Oh, great. Oh, phew. Come on, get a crit, get a crit, get a crit, something, oh. Palmer, I think you got this. Or maybe not. You know what? You're t you might be two for two, Montaro. Oh, health tipping in the yellow. Nice, level 15. Well, I nearly had my big chance to say goodbye to one of my partners, so, uh... My strategy is, as of this recording... To not only get my Route 8 capture, but will also avoid a good chunk of trainers. Right there. Wait. Oh shoot, that's right. Terra new dig and cut. Yeah, let's forget. Let's forget Scratch. Besides, cut his better anyways. Oh, I thought I glitched out for a moment there. Oh, if I could... First off, let's see what this bear is. Aleppa Berry. Not bad, but... Not good enough. Biker Dude. Yeah, I'm not... I'm trying to avoid... I'm going to avoid those four trainers for right now. Let's see what we've got right here. Oh, more berries. Lumberry. Oh, here's our encounter. And it's a... A Pidgey. Dupes, cl Dupes Claws. A 
Rouse Berry, huh? It's better than nothing, I suppose. But still. Alright, let's see what we got here. It's a hobble, Haji, hobble. Oh my, holy, holy, holy mother of Arceus, that's a shiny Eggins! We gotta catch it! We gotta catch it, it's a shiny! I've never encountered a shiny in this game before in my life! Oh. Joni, get out here! Paralyze it, something! You know what? Stunt board. Come on! Come on! Yes! Alright, got the paralyze. Let's go for a ball. Oh goodness. This is turning out to be quite an eventful night. Quite an eventful night indeed. One, two, three. On the first ball! Yes! Well, I th you know, I think it's time we give Nagini a, a good friend. Hmm. Let's see. Gold Snake. I did not know. I actually didn't know what a shiny Ekans would even look like going into this. But, hmm. Good, a good name for this. Good name for an Ekans. A shiny Ekans. This is this is gonna take a good chunk of this. It's already Eesh, we're already 14 minutes in. Probably four minutes and this just went to, went to Oh my gosh, shiny Ekans. Because it's, because it sounds like Ouroboros, the snake that eats its own tail. And it also mixes with, uh... oh shoot, I'm going to have to fight that guy. I'm going to have to fight that guy after all. 
because he's standing between me and the underground path to Celadon City. And he's got electric types. Of course. And like half of my team is there. Almost half of my team. Let's do this, Aiden. Come on, get the poison! Ugh, darn it! That's a crit hit lowered with... Lowered with Screech? much to worry about, and I'm still not taking the chance. Slash is high enough, and I'm pretty sure it doesn't even learn any electric-type moves until a certain level. Bite, bite, come on, bite it. So what if it's faster? Hmm. Ugh. Electric steel. Steel means fighting weakness. Oh, come on, Montaro, you got this. I hope. Oh, please don't knock him out. No, 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 Montaro, my boy. Thank goodness Sonic Boom is fixed damage. Yeah, there ain't no way I'm lasting this long without using held items. <sighs> it may not be as effective, but gets the job done. Ooh! Oh, my neck! Ooh! A cough? No, I think I got this. I definitely need to heal up. I have never been more grateful for Joni's hidden power to be psychic type, I tell you what. Not to mention, coughing's poison type attacks won't do anything against him. And it's already done! Joni's gonna level up. Um, possibly level up. First, let's slow it down. That's more like it. Uh, hidden power again. I swear, Joni may become just one of my big heavy hitters. Uh, as it is effective against... As it is thankfully effective against electric types. 
least it isn't uneffective. Oh goodness. Burping. I hate acid reflux. Meltdown indeed. But I will. We. Sleepy Pokemon up here near Celadon City. I'll get my Route 7 encounter a little bit later. Oh, look, Team Rocket. First, get my Mons healed up. And let's check on our shiny encounter. <laughs> Ooh, oh, my neck. Oh, criminy. So a poke flute is basically a dog whistle. Nice. But you don't, so there. I swear I need to get some kind of... Oh. Level 17, eh? Naive nature. Rap, leer, poison sting, and bite. But what a beauty she is. Oh, I got this. Ugh. There. That's better. I don't need to bend down my neck. And I can actually use this table that I'm putting my uh, microphone on now to uh, hold on, I'm moving the stuff off of it, including my car keys and my wallet. And there's my ride! <sighs> you know what? If my encounter on Route 8 is a shiny, I do not is a shining duplicate of another Pokemon? I do not mind. Especially, just look at how beautiful, golden, shiny she is. Ugh. I made the conscious decision of taking the route over here to avoid uh, all of those trainers, not because I probably couldn't beat them, but... Oh, hey! Mr. No found another Chesto Berry. Let's get that off of him first. <sighs> but because I did want to get a proper Psychic type at the Celadon Game Corner, You stay out of my way. Yeah, right. Sarah standards won't let you punch anybody. I would like to see you try. Oh yeah. Yeah, they won't get a they couldn't get away with that in the remakes. It's full of strong trainers. Yeah, sure you tell yourself that, Jiraiya. Or Roshi if you want to get a little older. This guy? Oh no wait, this guy.
I just wanted to say hi, sheesh. That does make me feel a little bit, uh, better about, uh, about getting Pokemon from the game corner because I'm technically saving them from a life of indentured servitude and, you know, being used and abused by... by Team Rocket. This from the Celadon Mansion, which is also where Game Freak's office is located. <coughs> and boom, just like that, I can now go to Saffron City, where it's mostly overrun by Team Rocket. But still, this means I can actually I can go up to Celadon too. Speaking of which, let's see who's in the uh I forgot who's in the uh who we left in the daycare. Let's see who's in there. Echidna. I don't think it's like an actual echidna Pokemon. It's like probably some kind of snake. I can't remember. Magikarp. And how much does she have to... Yeah, you know what, let's leave her back in. it back to Celadon because we can now raise the tea lady I would go to the fighting dojo but they are way beyond my level right now and uh, let's Sip on into the game corner and pick up those coins. There are some. Like, there are some cool coins on the floor. In the. I totally forgot he was here. Oh, I wasn't thinking of taking her lightly. Trust me, they don't.
So 50 coins right now. Oh, and I need 100 and... when it's right. Hundred coins. Let's give him a nick. Let's give him a good nickname.
I'm looking at this website of nicknames for Abra. And... Wow, Accelerator. I just started... I just started, you know, I just started watching Railgun and y Yowza. Just, wow. Mob, Zelda, Sabrina, Hitoshi. Tetsuo! Penn and Teller. And Casey. Hmm. No, I think I've got it. I don't know why I didn't think of this before. Excuse me, I just said his name is Merlin. Now then, let's let's see his let's go see his stats. Level nine. Not too bad, but not too good either. I mean, he's got a lot of we got a lot of work to put in this little guy. Swap out Katie. And, uh, I think Montaro can wait for now. If only because I really, really, really want to see. I really want to raise her up a little bit. I've never caught. I've n I, never in my wildest imaginations did I think this would happen. Look at that. That's mine. I caught that. Oh, oh, the frame is around the name is even different. I've never noticed that before. Then again, I've never caught a shiny in this game before, so... Am I of a good nature? Increased speed, decreased special defense. Well, it isn't too bad, honestly. it up speed. I say that's a good nature. You know, I think, right now I think that's a good place to stop for now. Plus it's a little late. We'll continue our journey in the morning. Or, you know, whenever. For now, this is Francis Xavier, logging off.